scream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. <laughs> I remember that as a child. I don't know how many of you know that one. But, <laughs> greetings everyone, Lily Farm Guy here with a new mod test for Thursday, September 29th. And this is Ice Cream Production by LSMT Modding Team 8.05 megabytes to download, so not too bad on the megabytes to download. It comes with two placeables. We have an ice cream factory and a sell point for the ice cream. And we'll look at both of those, see how they work and go through the particulars of each one. First of all, we gotta make the ice cream. So, productions, factories, and amongst the others, uh, there it is, ice cream production, uh, $120,000, 17 slots on console. This is for all platforms and place it down like so. The business end is at the back, uh, well, the side and the back. Let's get our help window on here. Not that it helps much with this, but you see uh, field information, very nice. Uh, the trigger is here for the uh, factory uh, trigger uh, spawning area here input is here a very nice generous large area we're going to show that uh, um, putting product in there uh, in a moment we will we're going to run the factory but let's have a look at the recipes shall we we can produce chocolate ice cream and strawberry ice cream the only difference between the two recipes is the strawberries or chocolate and it is a 2400 cycles per month 70 liters per cycle uh, incoming materials milk chocolate sugar honey and strawberry honey is a bit of an odd one well not odd because we have honey so there it is that's part of the recipe as you can see the amounts hundred thousand each for sh uh, milk sugar and strawberries uh, chocolate and honey, oddly enough, are at a lower capacity. Now, that's a little bit odd because hmm, you would think the strawberries and the chocolate would be the same because they're exactly the same in the recipe. After, uh, yeah, what? Anyways, um, it is what it is. We're going to run, uh, say, the let's run the chocolate by itself. Uh, because they're both the same so we'll know what the production is for one of them and then uh, and then we'll the, we'll run the other one just to see what the crates look like <coughs> so that is um, that is that now the sell point now let's just be out of curiosity's sake we'll, we'll take a look at the uh, straw or the strawberry and uh, the ice cream cell prices and uh, we see that the sell everything point that I have on uh, all my tests is also takes the ice cream so you don't have to place the corner shop sell point and it looks like the prices are roughly within yeah it's it's right within the range of all of my other sell points there so um, uh, just just so you know that you're not going to get some kind of extra special uh, price now this looks like uh, one of the base game housing decorations it strikes me as looking like one of them um, here's the sell point area here hmm uh, maybe not I don't know I'm not sure it just looks like it uh, where do we find that well we'll find that under production and selling points and there it is the corner shop forty thousand dollars so a little bit pricey for um a sell point but very decorative it is 15 slots on console now if you don't want to pay the forty thousand dollars for a sell point uh, you can get one of these cell points down here from Schultz Modding 
uh, it is only um, a uh, thousand dollars just so you know that's what I have over here that's where the other sell prices are all right so um, we have turned it on um, upkeep daily upkeep is $85 per day um, yeah and the sell point does take things other than ice cream just so you know uh, if we take a quick look through that I do believe uh, what does it say um, flour sunflower oil canola oil olive oil cheese tomato lettuce strawberries grapes grape juice eggs sugar cake bread potatoes milk olives and road salt those are the things that the sell point also buys uh, corner shop there we go up at the top that's sugar so the that's the description on mod hub uh, tells you gives a list of things that it buys actually so we're gonna go sleep and we're gonna see what our ice cream production looks like we're already got 197 liters in there so we should get a fair bit and we should see uh, what it's all about so we'll see in a bit okay so we're back and let's have a quick peek at our production and bazinga a hundred thousand liters of uh, chocolate ice cream has been produced just over the one well it's one month one night sleep i have one day months um so as you can see the other items milk has gone down about by about uh, almost half uh, the chocolate's almost all gone sugar by a quarter honey by a third and of course we didn't have the strawberries one turned on so we'll turn that on turn that one off set that to i don't know distributing so it doesn't pop out let's have a look at it chocolate ice cream there it is chocolate ice cream thousand liters it is not liftable so they do weigh significant 760 kilograms now well there's quite a lot out here there's a nice big spawn point i like that <clears throat> i i i my one of my pet peeves is having too small of a spawn point so there we go lots of lots of chocolate ice cream out here melting in the sun now of course like other um, factories you cannot take the raw materials out once it has been put in so let's just for one moment we have uh, the uh, the Raleigh Christie one uh, multi auto load trailer here for pallets let's see if it'll pick up the ice cream mm ah yes look at that so the auto load pile at least this auto load um trailer will pick up the ice cream the trigger is a little finicky but it does do it a little messy like i said but there you go uh, and I'm sure if you try some of the other auto load ones, um, they will also work. I can't guarantee they all will work, but this one certainly does, as you can see here. So we're going to just um, load up some of these. Excuse me. Mm and uh, what do we got here 8700 liters so uh what is that going to uh what kind of cash is that going to give us sixty five thousand dollars that's pretty good all right so uh ingoing materials uh now we didn't uh, we didn't okay we have the we have the strawberry ice cream turned on now let's just kind of uh speed time forward a little bit so it'll use up some strawberries because we have strawberries and crates here these are liftable because i have the liftable and like you as you can see it, it will take strawberries and crates and let's just turn that off again 
honey well you can take honey in crates as well or um, if you don't want to uh, grow all your own products or whatever you can always just uh, use this trailer and buy say the uh, chocolate you need for the recipe now because um, if you think about it a place that makes ice cream isn't going to make all the ingredients that goes in like sugar they don't produce sugar they buy the sugar that goes into the um, into the recipe they, they buy all the ingredients they're a manufacturing place that buys the ingredients and makes ice cream of different flavors so uh, it is not unrealistic to be going and buying ingredients from somewhere to uh, to make ice cream now let's see here this looks like the strawberry there it is there's the strawberry ice cream so that's what it looks like we just fast forwarded it a little bit and we've already produced uh, 3300 liters plus what else is out here so very 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 quick production you'll be swimming in ice cream before you know it now the uh, sugar I have the industrial sugar mod so I can buy bulk sugar but um, if you don't want to do it uh, with the auto load trader trailer and uh, the uh, buy anything you can also um, there's a number of mods that you can buy pallets of anything really <clears throat> we have pallets of sugar that's the industrial sugar mod but you can also buy sugar in pallets uh, liftable pallets mod has sugar it has uh, what else was the ingredients um, strawberries you can buy pallets of chocolate oh, any of the ingredients you can you can buy uh, let's see here tomatoes sunflower sugar strawberries there's the strawberries um, I do believe there's one that you can buy there's honey so literally all the ingredients can be purchased in the store uh, chocolate and milk you can buy um, I think there is actually a pallet of milk so one of the mods has a pallet of milk as well so there is there is there is a uh, plenty of different ways to buy the ingredients um, yeah and oh we didn't show it selling this selling the ice cream at this point dingling right okay let's let's load up some strawberry ice cream then and we'll show you selling it at the actual sell point that comes with the mod that would have been nice that would have been smart too isn't it right so there we go we got some fourth uh, oh and it's uh that's still making ice cream <laughs> Right, there we go, 6,000, 7,000 liters, and it's still spawning. <laughs> and there we go, there's the ice cream. So you can see it sells quite easily. Make a pile of money. Uh, let's see, if you want to do it kind of the old-fashioned, let's see if we can push a... Oh, no. We can also just take, take the... Uh, take the crates and push them over there but um, anyways yeah they're not liftable I'm on a PS5 so they weigh 700 kilogram actually a full one let's see your full one 760 kilograms so can't pick that up on console uh, you'll either need a forklift or a um, auto load trailer of some sort to transform but there you go that's uh, <coughs> that's the ice cream production by LSMT modding team 8.5 megabytes of download seven, 17 slots for the factory 15 slots for the cell point thank you for watching I'm Lonely Farm Guy and remember it's only a game
So till next time, bye for now.